The Boys Season 2, Episode Number 7. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here to next week's episode of The Boys, one away from the season finale until we are done with The Boys until Season 3 comes out, for that matter, anyway. And it's going to be a banger of an episode, man. Everything is coming to a head. Huey's injured. He's in the hospital. But it seems like... Um, it seems like Starlight and Butcher are kind of starting to yeah. have a little bit of a connection. Not in a weird way, but in the sense of maybe Butcher isn't going to want to kill her 24-7 anymore. And then we had everything happen with Lamplighter. You know, Mallory, Frenchie. We got some backstory there finally on that whole situation on how her kids died. On what happened with Frenchie and everything like that, man. And it's just kind of cool getting all these little extra details and bits like that. You know what I mean? Because you notice throughout the series, like, I don't know, like, M.M. always tells Frenchie, like, stick to the plan, stick to the plan, stick to the plan. Whenever he does, like, anything that's not related to the plan. And I feel like that's probably why, because, you know, originally during that time, the plan was for Frenchie to follow Lamplighter, and he didn't, and that's what happened. So, you know, it's kind of cool seeing those details kind of connect, you know, and actually come, like, full circle. But I'm super excited for this episode, man. I feel like it's going to be a good one. I don't know what the fuck is gonna happen. Um, that one crazy bitch got out from last episode that can just. She can kill everybody. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, I wanna see her face Homelander. I feel like she could kill him. Yeah. You think she could just do that to him too? Cause like right now, nobody can kill Homelander. I don't know. I wonder what her power actually is. Cause like Kamiko's brother was like, what, telekinesis kind of like that? Like he can move shit with his hands, he could crush mm -hmm. it. So is that technically like what her power is? Because. She just on like, another level maybe because she did it to doors too mm, i don't know she can like explode people from the inside it looks like it. They, like, just like <laughs> i know that's what i'm saying like almost like i don't know like maybe she can she, maybe she's just like on another level compared to kamiko's brother in that sense i don't know it's kind of weird it's kind of hard to explain i just don't know what her powers are but i feel like she i feel like she might be the key to taking down homelander because right now, I feel like nobody can really stop him or hurt him or anything like that. But maybe she can. But regardless, guys, we're super excited for this episode. So we're going to stop wasting time. We're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this episode. Before we do, we do ask if you guys are new to the channel. And do hit that subscribe button. Comment down below what you guys want to see next. Man, drop a like on the video for us. For reaction to be up on Patreon as well as early access to the next two episodes. If you guys are going to check that out, link in the description down below. We're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this episode. We haven't even gone back to uh, Homelander's kid or anything like that. Like, I feel like the whole start of the season was that. And Homelander was like, I'm not going to get bored. And then I don't think we've been back since that episode. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you something I probably shouldn't. I'm going to tell you something that the government doesn't... Is he obsessed with Stormfront? Uh, have a good day, hon. But why does it matter what some super villain loving snowflake has? Every minute he wastes... Dude, stuck in a cycle. Did you see the title? It said Stormfront defends people who attacked homeless immigrant. Oh, Whoa. I saw the light in your eyes. Just, just take the money. You one of them? You fucking super villain? What? Are you bulletproof, motherfucker? No, please, I have a family. Please. Damn. All because he wasn't American. See. Like, the news can push an agenda, and it affects people like this in the real world. I know this is kind of taking it to an extreme, but, like, shit like this happens, man. This normal person just in their own cycle, they see this shit on the news again and again and again and again. They do shit like that. And that's what creates so much hate and racism. How can you not want blood from what he done? He's willing to speak against Maude at the hearing. We've never had Congress on our side before. Congress? Please. What a bunch of corrupt fucking cunts they are. Oh, come on, you're not the first person to call me a cunt, Mr. Butcher. I'm starting to think it's like a badge of honor. Timber than dealing with where I come from, love. He'll be a good witness. It's not enough, though. Not enough? If torturing and burning a bunch of mentals on board say so ain't enough for you, Muppets, then what the fuck are you good for? That's what I'm saying. Okay, we know what they were doing at Sage Grove, but we don't know why. Why test Compound V on patients? What do they want? I need the full picture. If we're gonna take a shot at the king, we can't fucking miss. We know someone who might know the full picture. Starlight? Or was she talking about uh, Becca, Butcher's wife? Let's get away from all of this. Get away from Bart. Escape for a while. Mm -hmm. I Don't work like that no more. She cleared what? With, with Ashley at Bart. 
You called them? Yeah, about an hour ago. Why? Mom, they, they could be looking for oh. Fucking idiot. Her mom don't understand. Damn, Black Noir. Noir, however you pronounce it, fuck. <laughs> oh, man. Son of a bitch, man. We got a very important job for you. We need you to look after our star witness. Hey, you guys want to watch Deep Does It in the Blowhole? What the fuck? <laughs> Hello, Mum. Hey, Billy. You ain't been picking up. He's dead. Your father's dead. Hmm. You there? When did that happen? I need to see you right now. Damn, it's just stuff getting stacked <sighs> on top, on top, on top, on top. One thing after another, man. Fuck. Yo, Bill, I mean, Butcher's been experiencing, like, the whole spectrum of motion, emotions from the finale of season one to now. I lit my first fire at four, burned my whole house down. My dad. He was so proud. My son's a soup. I was going to do great things. I almost did. Now look at me. I'm like the cuck in the porn. Sitting on the sidelines while the real heroes were out there doing the fucking. I watched my dad do nothing his whole life. But me, I thought I finally found something. I thought I found what I was meant to do. But it turns out I'm shit at that as well. You're not the cuck. Actually, you're worse. You're the cuck fluffer. <laughs> They almost look alike, like he could be his dad. A little bit, huh? I don't know. I feel like they look a little bit alike. <laughs> I've always been honest with you. You know that. And I gotta be honest with you now. Brings me no pleasure to tell you this, but we also had a mole in the seven. That's right. One of our own. Starlight. I know. I know. It's okay. She's been apprehended, and she can't hurt anyone else. I can't believe this. Okay, this is insane. I thought he was watching the news. <laughs> what the fuck? With the who murdered in cold blood. Uh, I bet you she's in 42D at the tower. Suit proof, mostly. Steel walls, six feet thick. How do I get in? Into the tower? Yeah, you don't. And I'm sorry, man, but she's probably dead. Vot screwed you over, right? Well, now they're trying to do the exact same thing to her. This shit is over for me. My whole life is over, okay? Come on, I mean, do you, you wanna be the cuck or do you wanna be the guy who fucks the wife? <laughs> He's like, well, when you put it that way. <laughs> yeah, 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 let's go fuck the wife. Consensually, come on, come on. <laughs> Consensually. <laughs> Jesus, man. I kinda like Lamplighter, I feel bad for him. His story seems kinda tragic, like, he killed the kids, but he didn't mean to, which kind of sounds like not a good enough excuse, <laughs> but still. You. Uh. What, no, I... You step one inch closer, and I'll kill you quicker than that fucking ass cat, son. But I, I never got a chance to say goodbye to Lenny, and I don't want that with you. You didn't have a chance to say goodbye to Lenny? You're the fucking reason he's dead. You don't have the fucking right to mention his name. Oh, fuck the love Lenny. But he wasn't hard like you. You beat the fucking shit out of both of us, didn't you? Maybe I'll push you a bit hard. That look at ya. You afraid of anything? No. Are you the strongest bastard you know? Yeah. <laughs> Tougher than I ever was. Oh, you're welcome, asshole. That ain't no excuse, man. You're a fucking monster. I'm just for the know. Jeez. Lenny could never have done that. Christ. Lenny. He literally just choked him a little bit. He's fine. She acts like he killed him or stabbed him or something. <laughs> what have you done? 
his so his dad was just abusive and shit and an asshole, man. You can make a you can make a kid strong and tough without abusing him, man. You know what I mean? Your daughter? Yeah. Eighty years ago, she looked exactly like that. Probably wants a kid again. There's something I want to show you. You want to finish off the backyard? Okay. Of course. This person. Let's bring another asshole to meet your kid. Ryan does have powers, but his mom doesn't like to talk about them or use them. Can you also let me know before you just pop by? He's Ryan's father. He has a right to see his son. Uh, that's very true. But look, we all just have Ryan's best interests at heart, yes, right? Yes, we do. I'm really sorry I haven't been here enough. Ryan, uh, really like you to get to know Stormfront. Damn, man, that's so fucked up. I really hope his son is strong as shit and can take him down. Tell him it's Grace Mallory. <laughs> so say no more. <laughs> God damn. We on the wrong team. <laughs> damn right. I thought you were tired. Dr. Vogelbaum, I thought you were taller. <laughs> Doc, what do you know about the Sage Grove Center? Never heard of it. Should I have? Well, considering Bart's been doing illegal tests there since you were the CSO, and they're still doing them to this day, seems like you should have. That's horrible. Maybe it was Sun and Shine's project over in R&D, but some things are more important than the right thing. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, Irvin Yalomi once said you, you die twice. Once when you stop breathing, and again when somebody utters your name for the last time. I'd like to hear about your family. Keep them alive a bit longer. If you'd ever like to teach me. Point is taken. Never mind. Gonna sell him the sign for it. I'm seeing gun. Probably, yeah. She's gonna finally teach him so they can talk, man. It'll be cool for them to finally be able to have conversation together. Eagle the Archer. Oh, he's like a brother to me. Yeah, he was there for me when I was They want him in too. He's the most kind loving person that you he's ever... a toxic personality and no church members are to have any contact with him whatsoever yeah no now that you Doop. complete 180. <laughs> he claims the program had failed him but actually he failed the program he doesn't exist you of understand ah. oh come on i think they're gonna do the limbo <laughs> oh, yeah? maybe he had a relapse or whatever Went back to his old ways and the church just said, fuck him. So weird. Or maybe something else happened and he's trying to hide it or something. Yeah, maybe they did something to him. I forgot that storyline was even going on with A-Chain in the deep. Yeah. I wonder, but the, the A-Chain just can't run fast anymore because his heart is fucked. You know what I mean? It's not like he did some fucked up shit. He's just not the same A-Chain. And boom, bitches. Uh, still in the system. I'm telling you, they look like they could be father and son. I can't be the only one that sees it. You protect his blind side, okay? When you look at him, you think of me. <laughs> wow. This motherfucker would be making millions on YouTube. Did you know that your dad has his own roller coaster? Mm -hmm. Do you want to take a ride on your dad's roller coaster? Can I not? We can talk about it. Whenever you want. <laughs> What a bitch. And she can't even do anything about it because she ain't a soup. I was raised the same way as him. That kid doesn't know anything about anything. When he sees the outside world, he is going to panic. And that's going to fuck him up. Mm. I mean, I guess in a His way it kind of is similar. It's different. It's not he the same. Has a mother. And I know that that means something to you. I do. And if you take him away from me, this... This whole world will feel so confusing yes, and frightening. But... Look, we have this opportunity to give him a, a childhood you never had. We can do that if he's here with me. Please, I'm begging you, please. I get what Homelander's trying to say. It's not the same because he's raised with love and not in a lab, but he's not, he's not getting the real world, you know? Like, when he gets thrown out there, he's gonna get, he's gonna get destroyed. So I kind of agree with both, you know. I think he should. I think his mom should be the one to take him out into the real world, <laughs> not Homelander. What was he like? 
Who? Homelander, growing up as a lamb, what was he like? When he was a little boy, five or six, he was quite sweet. He'd cuddle up to me. He loved stories about Davy Crockett, Teddy Roosevelt. Loved the idea of the woods, the forest, manifest destiny. But you know, I needed him to be the strongest man in the world. So I went to work on him. He didn't even want it. Homelander is just a product of what they made in reality. So I'm about to go into that room next door to your door, and I'm gonna bash your brains out. And then I'm gonna find your two sons and their wives and their little kiddies. Your whole fucking family dies today. <laughs> or you help me. Butcher's dark too, man. Like, I know he's on our side and fine for the good side, but he's dark too. How? How can, can you be so... How can you be so what? You, this dude literally destroyed his life, so I get why Butcher's really willing to do that to him. He took Rebecca from him and everything, and he created Homelander. Mm -hmm. This is it, 42D. And she's gonna be there. I don't think Lamplighter would... There's nobody there. I don't think Lamplighter... Well, I hear some... I don't know, I think that's the music. I don't think Lamplighter would lead him into a trap on purpose. Lamplighter's just going uh, off what him, he thinks, yeah. though. No, not him, but people there. Oh, mm. Knowing that they're gonna come for her, you know. Maybe. I don't know. Could be. I oh thought he was about God. to kill himself. Oh. Holy shit. Oh. oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. No way. Oh my God. Oh my God. No way. Now they got Huey, too. Dude, fuck, Huey, you had one job, you bastard. Oh, maybe this was his plan. Oh, it gives oh, her light. Oh. This was his plan to sacrifice oh himself. God. Which, I mean, yeah, you get Starlight out, but bitch, now who's gonna testify? God, burnt to a crisp. Fuck you, man. I didn't want him to die. I actually like this character. <laughs> I know. I need his hand. <laughs> I need his hand. <laughs> Grab the one that's not as burnt, yeah. <laughs> Damn. Come on. Come on. Is the is, is the scanner even gonna read it when it's that dirty? You gonna have to go wash that shit off? Are they gonna see each other? I hope. Either each other or she's gonna see another suit. Oh, oh no. yeah. Oh my gosh. Why is she ain't using her powers more? <laughs> I think Huey has to save her. Who else? Oh, I was gonna say. Let's go. I was gonna say, I know we didn't just do all that shit for nothing, bruh. Oh, he's taking oh off. She's taking. An almond joy? Is he allergic to chocolate? He has a tree nut allergy. Mm. Damn, his, wow. his throat's probably gonna close up. He's not gonna be able to breathe. Wow. Damn, Queen Maeve. Okay, Queen Maeve's joining the squad too. <laughs> What a young man from Blue. Hi, it was January. Is that a human hand? Yes, it is. Come on, we gotta go. This is gonna win Huey some extra brownie points. He's about to pass out. I feel like at any moment. <laughs> I thought he thought Annie was gonna run into his arms. Oh. Is this the first time they've seen each other since she said they can't be together? I don't know. You're a liar. You lied to me. What do you mean? She just flew me up and showed me that this house is fake. The neighbors are fake. You're fake. Boy deserves to know the truth. Oh, yeah. Damn. Don't worry. He'll still have a mother. Wow. Hey, Ryan. Ryan. Hey, Ryan. No, Ryan. No. I knew this was gonna happen. 
That's fucked. I've been spreading slanderous and defamatory rumors about our religion in a desperate attempt to stay relevant. <laughs> Fuck him. I thought he was your friend. Hey, bartender, can we just change the channel? The hearing's almost done. Damn. So they, it sounded like they wanted, Eagle said they wanted him to cut his mom out of his life and he wouldn't. And that's why they leaked all that shit. Do you swear that the testimony you're about to give today will be the truth? The whole truth and nothing but the truth. I do. Thank you. You have five minutes to make your opening statement. Oh, oh my god. Oh, god. I think that's Stormfront doing that to people. Oh my god. Whoa. Yo, even him? All this. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, is it all me too? But that's the same thing that happened to the. Um... The people? No, no, no. The, the other. Yeah, that lady. Yeah. It's gotta be Stormfront, right? Jesus, man, fuck. Like, it's gotta be Stormfront. That's so crazy. That is so crazy. I was like, they can't... I, I thought they were fucked for sure because I was like, they can't take this dude out in front of everybody, but they just started killing everybody. And I mean, I guess they can deny it. I think... I think they... I think they killed Ashley. That one chick that talked to Queen Mate. I think they killed her... But I think they killed her so they can be like, look, we lost somebody in ours too. Like, how? why would we kill these people? Why would we kill some one of our own? You know what I mean? I think that's why they killed her. Because it looked like it was her that died. Like in one of those shots. I, I couldn't tell if it was her or not. I couldn't either. It, if they did though, I think that's their play. They did it probably to, as an excuse to be like, one of our own died too. You know, like it wasn't us. Mm -hmm. Or try to say that it was some terrorist or something. Yeah. But I, like how, who can that be? Like they couldn't have planted little, like, cause originally I thought like when that one lady got her head exploded before, I thought it was, um, I thought it was like a little chip planted in their brain. You know what I mean? Cause sometimes you can do that like up their nose and shit. And like you, when you trigger it, their head explodes, you know what I mean? But maybe it's Stormfront doing that. Cause that was a lot of people. There's no way they did that put something in all those people's heads right so it has to be like a soup doing that but it was also like the very same like explosion that from that one chick from last episode that, that broke everybody out uh i was thinking Sydney. about her but why would she no she has no like agenda right. to do that to them well i guess because she was unless, tortured by Vought. unless stormfront found her and it, you know yeah I don't know. I feel like it has to be Stormfront, but like, how could she do that? Like with her powers, like, I don't know, man. I'm so confused. I hope we find out like within the next episode or two, but holy fuck, man. What's their plan now? I feel like at this point, literally the only thing they can do is fight fire with fire. They got to assemble a team of fucking soups. They got, they already have Starlight. Queen Maeve is like at the turning point. They, they got people from the, 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 where they were being tortured at you know like that one dude that flipped the van sydney they, they have a bunch of people there they could use like i don't know i feel like the only way they can do is fight fire with fire and take down stormfront and home later it looks like a train and deep are kind of like opening their eyes and like what the fuck is going on you know type deal i don't know i just don't get i don't think there's any way they're gonna stop vaught the right way you know what i mean like i feel like they just gotta kill homelander and Stor stormfront Jesus, man, a lot happened this episode, and now Ryan's gone too from his mom and turned on her like that quick. <sighs> Dude, I just, it, it pisses me off, man, because Stormfront's such a bitch, but it's like she can't do anything about it, you know what I mean? It's, oh, man, 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 man. It was a good episode, though, man. We have one episode left in the season, and then we're going to probably be taking a break from the boys until season three comes out, but I've been loving the show so far. I, I really don't know how this season is going to end if we're going to wrap things up with this storyline or what you know i don't i hope we don't lose any characters that we like like butcher better not die frenchie mm um huey like those four characters better not die or i'd be pissed they're like the main characters I, I, of the I show i do have a feeling butcher is gonna die at the end i do have a feeling but like a sacrifice to kill homeland or somehow some way or something 
Like, I feel like, I feel like Butcher would do some shit like that, because we already had shades of that, like, foreshadowing of that earlier in the season, remember? When he was at his aunt's house, and he was going to sacrifice himself when Black Nora was there, or whatever. Or when he was going to explode, or when he, he exploded, he exploded yeah. So I could see him dying, but I don't want him to die, like... Aw, oh, dude, I just, I'm scared for next week, I'm scared for what's going to happen on the finale. I don't, I, I have no idea which way it's going to go, though, like... Crazy shit has to come from this. Like, Vought was about to get exposed and everybody's head started exploding. Like, the, the news it's and media can't just pass her. that. It's That's what I'm saying. Her. Like, it ha I feel like it has to be somebody doing that. Like, I don't think it's like a little thing planted in people's brains that's doing that. Like, somebody's power is doing that. It has to be her, I feel like. Like, there's no way it's not, right? Like, who else could it be? It has to be either her or Homelander. But Homelander looked kind of confused when shit started to go down. She kind of looked straight-faced, like... Like, it was nothing new for her. Yeah. Homelander did look a little bit confused. Like, yeah. not, like, shocked, but, like, confused. It's like, yeah. what the fuck is happening? Yeah, that is true. You know, so I think it is her. But I just, I don't know how she's doing it. Like, maybe with, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think she's doing it. But I think she has somebody else do it for her. Oh, uh, yeah. It could be that, too, but... I don't know, man. This show is just so fucking crazy. I feel like you never know which way it's going to go or turn, you know. But we also, the thing is, too, about, like, assembling uh, a team of soups to take down them. We also got Eagle now. He's kind of, like, out there in the world. I mean, we haven't really seen his powers and stuff, but I'm assuming he's just good with the bow, you know, kind of like Hawkeye. But, like, we got Queen Maeve. We got Eagle. We got the Deep. We got A-Train. Um, we got that that crazy bitch from the 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 the, the ward sydney i think was her name like there's there's a lot of options here but i just don't know if they would want to fight you know like i don't know if they would want to but even if they did what what what, what group of people could take down stormfront and homelander like before what group of people could take down homelander now they got stormfront on, now she, he got stormfront on his his side like fuck this is gonna be tough, man. I, I don't know, but it, it could like not even be an all-out war either. It's just something has to happen. Something big has to happen because they've tried so many times to take Vought down the right way through the law and everything, and they just get fucked every single time. So I feel like I feel like it's time to activate Plan Z. You know what I mean? Like the last resort plan. Like it's got to be all-out war. You know what I mean? Like you you take your group of people, I'll take my group of people, and we gonna go meet head to head. You know, and whoever comes out on top is it. I feel like that's what it's gotta be, you know? Like, we ain't gonna do none of this, like, this person did this, this person broke this law. Like, clearly that ain't working. Like, we just gotta go meet, square up, and whoever's the last man standing wins. You know, like a battle royale of soups or something, but... <laughs> I don't know, man. Regardless, guys, let us know what you thought about it in the comment section down below. Like always, also, if you guys did enjoy this reaction video, make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel. Hit that subscribe button for reaction to be up on Patreon as well as early access to a bunch of other stuff we're doing. If you guys want to check that out, link in the description down below. We hope you all have a wonderful day. We'll see you in the next one. What is going on, everybody? I hope you all did enjoy the video that you just watched. I want to give a couple quick shout outs to some of my highest supporters over on Patreon the homie Supernova. The homie That's So Gordo, the homie Dude Tim, and the homie Silas Kane. Shout out to you guys for supporting me at my highest tier over on Patreon, guys. Link is on screen right now as well as in the description down below to get access to a bunch of cool things such as early access, full-length reaction, polls, and tons of other stuff, man. Appreciate all you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.